BitTube.tv Today we're going to test a game that I've been meaning to test, uh, but I never got around to it. And that's Shadowgun War Games. It's a new game that just got released, I think two days ago. It just never booted it up. So today we're going to test this game out on the Adventure Shield tablet. So without further ado, let's begin. I am the mighty... You can count on me. Locked and loaded. Go, go, go! Ain't got time to bleed. Let's rock. Let's play. Okay, my first time doing this, so let me just make this quick. Mm, probably should have uh, been more prepared. Okay, no, let me keep going. <clears throat> so it's my first time playing this. I don't know if this game has controller support. I don't know if um, I'm going to have to map the buttons. Uh, that's going to be annoying. So, there's now just recently been an update, so I'm going to try giving this a quick go. So, from what I've seen, it should play similar to Overwatch. Uh, I already have Overwatch and uh, Realm, Paladins, etc, etc. So, I'm kind of used to this gameplay. What I really want to do is really test out, um, well, if it has controller support. So, hopefully, um, we should just get a couple of games. So, just... Um, Forgive me guys if it's a bit slow. So right now I'm pretty much just waiting for it to synchronize. There are a few stutters. Synchronizing data. So what's going to happen? Um, right now I'm recording just on the Shield tablet itself. So I wanted to test out to see if this uh, method works. There we go. While we wait for the load. Okay, it does seem to have controller support because I can move the uh, the mouse or, or the cursor, I would say. So right now, let me just log in with my Google Play games. As soon as it will let me. But uh, we can get through them. Anytime now. I touch, let me use the touch screen. So thank you for downloading our game. We hope you enjoy playing it as much as we enjoyed making it. Oh my gosh. Wait. Yeah, this is the when you when you start up games, this can happen. At least with me, sometimes I have to close it and then reboot it. So let me just try one more time. So there was one thing I wanted to ask the. Well, I'm not sure if it's going to be a good idea, but since all the indie games are now coming out for the PS Vita, I was wondering if they could uh, port some of the games for the PS Vita. Because. Mm, Indie games are still coming out for it, so although PlayStation has officially discontinued it, thought it might have been an interesting idea. But then again, Shield Tablet feels more like a console because I can use an actual controller, or if I wanted to, 
can use the IPEGA and mm, basically make it like switch. So right now I'm pretty much a. Uh, oh, let, let me just focus on the shield tablet. I'll probably ask that question later. So as soon as we're able to get in some gameplay, we will get going. The issue is it takes quite a while for things to load up. So as soon as this thing is loaded, we will get going. I'm not sure if I should pause the video or just wait. Uh, hold on, almost ready. Damn, this is wasting valuable time. Come on, how hard is it to log in via Google Play? Alright, give me a sec guys. I'll pause the video right here. Read onto the game and see what's going on. Slow zap. Yeah, so sorry about that guys. Let me just relaunch the game or reboot it. And hopefully things will go smoother. So, just bear with me. see how this game plays on the Nvidia Shield tablet. So Shadowgun War Games in a quick easy tutorial. So we're gonna do the tutorial real quick. Uh, I think this game has controller support so what we're gonna do is do this. Welcome to Shadowgun War Games. Before you jump into battle, let's go through the basics. shot. Impressive. Hold this for me, will ya? Fire in the hole. Great job. I ain't got time to bleed. So it does have full controller support. I am very happy for that. There are a few stutters. I think that's mostly due to the settings. But without further ado, let's try a quick game. See how. It goes.
change that name though. Most of the names are Rambos, well, except one, Rambo. But anyway, let's try and get this game out of the way. as hell man that is some bullshit Ugh, let me tell you right now the game is so buggy i can't i can barely play a match man's trying to get into a match and um i'm getting error codes and uh you know kick outs man all my days well let me tell you the game is really buggy right now as it is even with this update the game is really buggy not a good start Uh, the same thing with um, Modern Combat versus when it was first released. So bad that it was so bad. I want to get into and it can't get me in a match 
Because this is the third time I'm having to boot this game. I've finally been able to sign in, gone through the intro, gone through the tutorial. Now I just want to get into a damn match. But damn, one error after another. First, they'll kick me out of the match or kick me out of... It'll give me some kind of error. And then when I try to log in again, it works and then game just crashes, man. This is not cool, man. This is so not cool. Fire in the hole. Hold this for me, will ya? play it but it's just so buggy i can't even do one match so anyways guys this was a quick test this video is going to pretty much turn into a test rather than a, a demonstration so it, let me know what you think in the comments below uh, again most of my videos is going to be more focused on bittube.tv rather than youtube um, if you want to watch my videos early make sure you watch them on watch them on bittube.tv and uh, leave a comment there guys and as always guys this has been your boy brother shield take care and peace Thank you.